Badia Bob Rhodes Viva has emerged as the governorship candidate of the Labour Party in the forthcoming 2023 election in Lagos State. Rhodes Viva defeated Moshud Salvador in a keenly contested substitute primary that held in the state. He polled 111 delegate votes against Mr. Salvador's 102. The Labour Party has shown itself to have the capacity for what we're trying to bring to Lagos, which is transparency and accountability. I mean, everybody saw what transpired here. There are very few other parties in Nigeria that, you know, has been able to achieve this, rank off free, you know, and everybody got a chance to cast their votes. So um, it's a very good feeling. I, I feel that this is a party that is ready to form the next government of Lagos State. Everybody is obedient. Everybody is eager to be part of this new change. Everybody is eager to be part of a new Lagos. We are tired, sick and tired of the status quo that has plagued Lagos for over 19 years. So we don't have a problem of preaching. What we have a problem is creating structures for people to plug into, which we are going to do. We are going to do that right away. We are hitting the ground running. After the election, Moshul Salvador rejected the outcome of the exercise, saying it was marred by irregularities. You can see that the um, total accreditation was not the same thing with the total. It is because they, were, they have not perfected their rigging. So I reject it in totality because there are some ESCO that are not even supposed to vote somebody voted three times. A single person voted three times and we were looking at them. We, re we rejected it. They said, no, you cannot talk about it. Mm. These are the things that is going on. That is why you can see this something very, very close. I reject this result in totality. 